from pro athlete to startup superstar. Jeremy Bloom was an Olympic skier and NFL player. Now he's a startup CEO with a new show on CNBC. Adventure Capitalist focuses on innovation, evaluating new ideas in the sports and action category. TechCrunch sat down with Jeremy to get his take on sports technology. So you're a former athlete turned entrepreneur. We're actually seeing a lot of that these days. I recently sat down with Tony Hawk and Rob Deerdeck. Why do you think that is? Why do you think so many athletes are getting involved with startups? So I think there's a partly the aura around kind of being that next big tech CEO. Um, and then I think that there's just unlimited scale. There's so many people online. Gone are the days where you start a company brick and mortar. Um, and build out. I think a lot of people want access to billions and billions of people, so if they have a good idea, it can scale very quickly. So I think for those two reasons, you know, you're seeing a lot of professional athletes, you're seeing a lot of actors, you're seeing a lot of rappers get into tech, get into investing, get into Silicon Valley. And so you actually just started a show on CNBC, and it's about investing in areas, startups, where action sports meets tech. Mm -hmm. Are you seeing a lot of innovation in that space? Uh, so yeah, the show is like Shark Tank meets the great outdoors. And uh, we were um, in the Bahamas and there's this uh, English entrepreneur who's uh, invented an underwater jetpack. So you can swim like twice the speed of Michael Phelps, um, even if you're an, a very average swimmer. There's a bike that can go pretty much anywhere. It's got two front wheels, one on the back, fully electric. We're in the Mojave Desert, jumping it all over the place, very durable. And we saw a shark repellent. Um, uh, it kind of mimics the sound of an orca, and orcas are natural predators to sharks. And we watched the sharks like disappear. So it was a really fun show to shoot, given my background. I, I love the outdoor space. I grew up in Colorado, skiing, biking, hiking, and uh, been running my own company now for six years. So I really come in with the the operating experience, um, and have done some investing on the side as well. So it kind of combines all my interests. And your full-time job is the CEO of Integrate, which is a marketing company. Can you tell us a little bit more about what that is? Yeah, Integrate, we're in our sixth year, um, and uh, the company is just doing exceptionally well now. Um, we've raised over $40 million of capital, um, and it's software to help um, orchestrate the demand generation efforts for large enterprise customers. So if you think of Dell, HP, Cisco, Iron Mountain, those are all customers of ours using our software to help um, automate some of the disparate processes in, in acquiring customers. And uh, it's been fun, you know, when you start with an idea on a chalkboard and a, you know, a former professional athlete that knows nothing about starting a business, um, that journey has been really exciting for me. You know, I've generated over $150 million of revenue over a six year period and we're growing faster now than we ever have before. So. It's, a, it's an exciting time. So these days there's a lot of technology that improves athlete performance from wearable tech to, to sensors and drones that help track things. What are your favorites? So there's a company called Striver out of Stanford that's, that's basically virtual reality. And as a, as a professional athlete or any type of actual athlete, you usually visualize. So the night before the competition or the night before the game, you're in your mind thinking about what the defense might do if you're an offensive football player or whatever. Well, Striver's taking that to the next level. So now you actually put a virtual reality mask on and you see that defense that you're gonna go against and you see the different shifts. So mentally you can actually prepare in a real-time environment before that game. And that you can apply that not just to football but to Olympic sports and X game sports. And, and I'm really excited about that space because from an athletic point of view, that is a differentiator for, for in order for me to you know, take my game to the next level and prepare for that upcoming game. So companies like Striver, I think, are, are really exciting in the athletic space. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining us. It's my pleasure. Thank you for having me.